Good morning, y'all. Okay, so things I wish I would have known before I let a tooth decay in my head, part 57. The implant process takes months, multiple visits, and it's just annoying. Like, none of the procedures have hurt me, but it's just annoying. So, like, if you're afraid to go to the dentist, just do it, okay? It's not, it, it's all in your head. Nothing hurts, but it's expensive. I am now going to see my regular dentist. She's going to make my impression. And then I leave. And then I go back and see her again. And then she puts the crown on. It's like, you know, uh, for the implant, they removed my tooth, put the implant in my head. That had to heal. It took four months to heal. Then they go cut the gums back open. Then they place the abutment. Then you have to go get the impression made for your crown. Then you go back and get the crown put on. Like, it's a lot. And some places won't even do, like some, my periodontist was able to extract the tooth and put the implant in the same day. Some of them don't even do that. So like, just go get your teeth looked at, please. Because that being said, if you need an implant, just get it done. Like I'm so, I will do this. I would do this again if it meant, you know, like having a nice tooth there. But just go see your dentist, like do preventative visits, you know. So my, my appointment's over. Uh, the impression appointment only took 20 minutes, but while I was there, my dentist, Elizabeth, said, Dr. Corbin said, we had a cancellation for a cleaning. Do you just want to get your teeth clean while you're here? Well, sorry, I'm at the Chick-fil-A. So I said yes, so I got my teeth cleaned. It had been over a decade since I've had a cleaning because I was so afraid to do it. Um, but the lady who cleaned my teeth, Helen, she was so sweet. I loved it. She actually follows me mid cleaning. She's like scraping the barnacles off of my teeth and she's like asking me what I do. And then she's like, <gasps> when I just choked on my spit. Hang on, my food's coming. But she follows me and she was so sweet and so gentle and it's perfect. And ever she was perfect. And so I go back in three weeks to get the crown put on that they made the impressions for today. And then I have my next cleaning in July. A lot of people are messaging me saying, oh my God, your teeth are perfect. No, the hell they're not. If they were perfect, I wouldn't have these issues. And Helen, who was cleaning my teeth, um, she asked me if I flossed. And don't lie, because they no, I didn't lie. I said, no, I don't. Like, I, I hate it. I'm lazy. I don't like flossing. She said, you know, your teeth are beautiful, but you have to keep the foundation healthy. Also, you know. It took her a while to clean my teeth. <laughs> and yeah, I took that real pretty picture earlier of my white teeth, but I didn't show this side, did I? <laughs> catch me, catch me going through airport security with this thing. I can't wait next time I travel. Okay, so Target wasn't that bad. I just got some odds and ends. Um, my OG followers know. <laughs> these drops, okay, these are called Lumify. Um, and, and like two years ago, I started using them, but I was putting these drops in my eyes every single day. Well, I don't think they're to be made ever for you to put in your eyes every single day. Uh, they actually made my redness worse. Um, a lot of my followers know I got punched in this eye when I was like 18, 19. I have scar tissue growing over it. It's called a pterygium. I could get it sliced off, but it doesn't like affect my vision. And I can't even get my teeth clean. So there ain't no way in hell I'm getting sliced off. Anyway, it's bothering me today. There are days where it bothers me and it looks ultra red. Um, I'm going to, this is the perfect time to put my Lumify drops in. So I have not worn these. I haven't worn these for like two years. Let me tell you something about these drops. These are Houdini eye drops. Like, if you have an event to go to, like, like if you're getting married or if you're going to a party or if you're going on a date and you want your eyeballs to pop, put these drops in. They work in less than a minute. I will show you guys a before and after. I'm going to do it right now sitting in this car. 
Um, you know, if your eyes get red for any I don't know, maybe some of y'all do some activities that make your eyes red. Well, be, but don't you don't use them every day now. Okay, just get a good look at these eyeballs. Just put one drop. I think it's just one drop in each eye. Are you joking? Um, the drops are expensive. I just forgot how much these drops kick ass. The drops are expensive. So the small bottle that I got was $12. That's expensive to me for eye drops. And then the large bottle is 20 bucks, but um, I'll link it right here. And yeah, I took that real pretty picture earlier of my white teeth, but I didn't show this side, did I? <laughs> Somebody just messaged me saying that I need to tell people that it makes their eyeballs feel weird because it constricts the blood vessels. I don't, I don't feel anything, um, but everybody's different. So my eyes will stay bright like this all evening. But again, I was using them every single day for a really long time, and I was just making. Um, somebody just said, "Can we get the punched in the eye story, pretty please?" I've shared it before. I will share it again when I was in like, I was right out of high school. I think I was already in college. Went home to go to a party. It was out in the country. One of my buddies, he don't, it's not the country, but uh, one of my buddies' houses, Brad, and he had this hill on the side of his house and I was coming up the hill. My friend Jimmy was coming down the hill. He said, Mayor, everybody called me Mayor where I grew up. Not Mary, not Mary Beth, not MB. I was Mayor, like a horse. Uh, he said, Mayor, went to give me a high five, completely, he was trashed, completely hit, missed my hand, hit me in the head. My eyeball immediately started bleeding. I stayed, I rallied, I partied, I went home the next morning. Mom and dad already lived down here in North Carolina. I was living with my grandma Rosie and I went home that next day and she said, she was like terrified for me. My, well, it's hard to see now because I have the drops in, but my eye busted open and then it wasn't until I... It healed. Um, it was gross, but it healed. And it's amazing what our bodies can do. And, but then it wasn't until I moved to North Carolina, I was at the gym. And there was an eye doctor who used to go to the gym where I worked out, worked out. And he said, you need to see an eye doctor. I can get, I can get you in with somebody at Baptist. Baptist is a hospital here. And um, he said, you have a pterygium on your eye. I Googled it. Freaked the hell out. Um... I went and I saw this eye doctor and he said, you know, we can scrape it off, but your eye, your, I have 20-20 vision. He's like, it's not affecting your vision at all. It's just going to irritate. Um, it's just going to be irritated sometimes. It will get red. And so here we are. My vision's still great, but from time to time it'll get, um, all right. It's only 4.30, but I'm like taking my face off because I'm over it. So I'm getting messages going both ways regarding the eye drops. Um... Some people are saying that they do make their eyes feel a little bit tingly, but then it goes away. People are saying that it doesn't do anything to their eyes. They use them every day. Uh, again, everybody's different, so just use with caution, I guess. That's not the word. I'm making these eye drops sound like they're bad and they're not. Hey. What? Are you okay? Yeah, why? I'm filming. Okay. Are you okay? Yeah, no, I'm just up here filming, babe. Right. Look at that shiny ass forehead. Get out of here. Um, what else? Oh, so I got this cute. uses the restroom. How do I hear him peeing downstairs?
So I'm not gonna, it's too early for me to put on like my nighttime creams and oils and shit. But I am gonna use my Dime Eyelash Bow Serum. I love this stuff. It conditions my lashes and strengthens them, um, which was much needed after I had my extensions on for so long. And it just builds the hair follicle up. It's amazing. It improves the overall appearance of both your lashes and brows. And as always, I have a code with them for 20% off plus free shipping over 39 bucks. My code is MB. You can use it site-wide. They have amazing skincare and beauty products. They also have their perfumes that I am obsessed with. Everything's clean, cruelty-free, vegan. Love them so much. Ay. So swipe up. Use my code. I forgot to talk about this. This is like... Doesn't this look like, um, like strawberry cheesecake a little bit? So cute. I know I said I'm not putting, I'm going to put moisturizer on, that's it. And then rewash my face later and do all the other stuff. But speaking of me getting distracted, so a lot of times people will message me when they mean to message other people. So like if somebody shares my story with somebody else, they'll go to respond, but they end up messaging me. And a lot of times it's not good. Because they think they're messaging somebody else and they're just like talking shit about me. But somebody must have sent their boyfriend or, I mean, it was a guy. And like a lot of like guys don't watch my stories. Um, somebody must have sent him my story and his response came to me instead of the person that said it to him. Because I looked, he wasn't even following me. And he, his response was, this bitch is all over the place. Talking about me. And I know I am. Okay, but this two-piece set is, I picked it up because it was cute, and I wasn't going to buy it, just based on looks alone, but I picked it up. It is so soft to touch. It's from Target, and the brand is Stars Above. I got a large because, like, I'm not, I'm not trying to be cute at night. Like, I'm just trying to be comfy, you know? I could have sized down, but I don't want to do that. And I will be livid if I wash these, you know, if I wash something and it shrinks and then it's not comfy anymore. Like, so I bought a large, I don't like this outfit. I'm just sitting here thinking that like, I cannot believe I got hit in the eye and bled as bad as I did and stayed at that party. I stayed at that party and did not care. Like, if that happened to me now, I would, I was so dumb. Oh my God, I was so dumb. Okay, well, I guess I'm gonna get ready for bed and frickin' floss. And I'm gonna use my native whitening wild mint and peppermint oil toothpaste. Don't forget, I have a code with native. well 20% off use my code and you get free shipping 20% off plus free shipping on your first order with native and y'all know I'll be using the hell out of their body washes I love them so much they have their deodorants too that Deej Mama Deej swears by uh but you guys can swipe up right now